The head of ANZ says the bank has changed its processes after refunding nearly 400,000 customers, nearly $30 million of fees. The fees were wrongly charged to customers transferring money between their own accounts. We made the mistake, we found it, we fixed it and we gave the money back to our customers as quickly as we could. Elliot told the committee it was a mistake made by staff but he wasn't sure if they'd face consequences. Each time we fall short, we potentially harm a customer or a member of the community and for that I apologise. He revealed during the grilling that breaches by financial planners had increased by 700%, with 40 of them sacked for their mistakes. That suggests an internal culture which is at best negligent uh, and at worst deliberately structured to uh, charge fees to clients that you are not entitled to charge. Following evidence from ANZ and the Commonwealth Bank over the past two days, there are calls to set up a bank tribunal to handle customer complaints. Yes, we do want to see a, a speedy, uh, low-cost way for people to resolve uh, their complaints. The Labor Party wants a Royal Commission instead of the current inquiry and any proposed tribunal. NAB and Westpac executives will appear before Parliament on Thursday. Rhiannon Callio, QUT News.